Hey everybody, welcome back to another video. This is Jim and Crystal with Serpentine Dream. Um, like the title says, we got twins. Um, you guys remember on Clutch 2, where I had the little smaller moldy egg? I could tell there was a small snake in it, but, you know, you expect that as a smaller egg. I was just happy that, you know, there's actually something in it and it didn't just go bad. Um, well, I ended up being twins. So, um... You know, it, uh, I cut, ended up cutting it open. You know, well, you guys saw the video on that. And you can tell it was a small snake. That's all I could tell. And then I seen it kind of poking its head out one day. And then I go back and check it another day. It's still the same. Check the next day, and there's two heads poking out. I was like, sweet, we got twins. So, um, long story short, and I will actually have a video of that. I, I did a quick 20, 30 second clip. I'll post that into this video that we guys can kind of see what I saw. Um, so I end up uh, waiting. The whole clutch came out of the eggs. I ended up putting them up in a, in a tub, got them all together until they shed out. And these two just, they crept out a little bit more out of the egg, but they never made it, you know, all the way out. So I was like, well, okay, I'm going to cut some more of the top of this egg off. So I end up cutting the whole top section off. Just to kind of uh, see if maybe they were just stuck in there or what was going on. And a few days later after that, they still were just kind of hanging out the egg. They were out more, but they wouldn't come all the way out. So I finally decided to kind of help help, get, help them get out of the egg. I slowly pulled them out. So I want to make sure they weren't attached to anything. And they weren't. They actually came out pretty easy. Uh, so I pulled them both out, got them separated. And here's the egg, just for kind of a reference. Um, one of the babies was curled up in here on the side, and the other one was on the opposite side right here. And they were just, you know, they hardly had any room. The rest of that's yolk that just hardened up, and then also, uh, you know, probably some of what they were supposed to digest, uh, being how small they were. And I don't think they digested probably near as much as they, uh, they could have if they were by themselves, but, so yeah, the egg, uh, it's kind of interesting on the inside as well. Yeah, tiny egg, moldy egg, and got twins. You guys a little better look at them here. I mean, those aren't gorgeous. Cute, tiny, tiny, tiny little babies. I'll show you just how tiny they actually are. I'm sure you can see in my hands, but I'll pull out one of the uh, litter mates here, just for reference. All right, here's one of the litter mates. Yeah, that's how tiny these babies are. So yeah, this is the uh, Het Red GHI clutch. <laughs> and, uh, so yeah, I got the two uh, the two twins in their own separate uh, container. I didn't put them with the rest of the uh, the snakes. They're they're so small. I'm afraid they get crushed. Or eating as tiny as they are, they may mistake them for something else to eat. But yeah, I mean, just the body, if you can just, it's crazy how much bigger uh, the normal babies are compared to these two twins. But they are gorgeous. I'll go ahead and put this one back up for now. Give you guys one more look at these two cute, adorable little babies. And hopefully they pull through okay and they don't seem like anything is wrong with them. Besides being extremely tiny. Uh, so, we'll see. Hopefully they both uh, make it alright and start feeding good and we don't have any issues there. And I'll definitely be holding on to these, my first set of twins, so if they do survive, uh, which they should, they seem fine, I'm definitely not going to be getting rid of them. But anyway, thanks for uh, thanks for watching. Please like if you enjoyed the video. Subscribe if you haven't. If you, I'm sorry, if you haven't. And um, stay tuned for the short little clip I'll throw on at the end here, uh, where you can see the two heads kind of coming out of that moldy little nasty egg. 
All right, thanks, guys. Hope you're having a great afternoon. Check that out, guys. How that little egg that was all moldy. Twins. Tell me that's not sweet. So, yeah, like I said, don't throw out your moldy eggs. Try to keep them around if you can. And, uh, yeah, when I opened those last night, I was like, man, that baby's little. I wonder if it's twins in there. And then I just looked in this afternoon, and we have two little heads poking out. So, I'm going to leave them alone for a little bit longer. And, uh, We'll see when they all come out.